The Ascod II family of armored vehicles was developed by General Dynamics European Land Systems. Headquarters of this company is located in Spain. General Dynamics continues to improve the original Ascot and proposes various variants. Development of the second generation of vehicles began in 2004. Ascot 2 is much more technologically advanced than its predecessor. It features an improved hull design, new engine and transmission, new automotive components, modified driver position, advanced sensors and a number of other improvements. This vehicles are more protected than their predecessors. Normal weight of the Ascod 2 vehicle is about 30 tons. It can be increased to 42 tons, so it is significantly heavier than the previous Pizarro and Ulan. The Ascod 2 offers higher level of protection than its predecessor. Vehicle has an advanced modular armor and innovative mine protection. Hull floor has a special shape, plus there is a layer of add-on composite armor. Also vehicle has a higher ground clearance due to redesigned suspension. Crew and passengers are seated on mine blast resistant seats. The new Ascot 2 withstands blasts equivalent to more than 10 kg of TNT anywhere under the hull or under any track location. Add-on armor kit can be fitted when needed. Newer armor modules can be fitted once these become available. Some sources report. Once add-on armor is fitted vehicle withstands hits from 25mm armor-piercing rounds from any direction. The Ascod 2 can be also fitted with modern electronic countermeasures and survivability systems. Vehicle can be fitted with Raphael Trophy Active Protection Systems. It is believed that the Ascod 2 with maximum level of protection is one of the most protected vehicles in its class protection level might approach that of the German Puma infantry fighting vehicle. The baseline infantry fighting vehicle has a crew of three, including commander, gunner and driver. It accommodates about seven troops, depending on the version. In the armored personnel carrier version it has a crew of two and carries eight troops. Dismounts enter and leave the vehicle via rear doors. Also there are roof hatches for observation, firing and emergency exit. The Ascod 2 can be fitted with various armament, depending on the version. A baseline armored personnel carrier can be fitted with remotely controlled 12.7mm machine gun. An infantry fighting vehicle version can be armed with a turret mounted 25, 30, or even 40mm cannon. Ascod 2 is powered by a German MTUV 8199T21 turbocharged diesel engine, developing 805 horsepower. Engine is located at the front. It is mated with a rank HSLW 256B6 speed automatic transmission. If required, the Ascod 2 can be also fitted with hybrid propulsion. <laughs> General Dynamics developed various versions of the Ascod 2 to meet requirements of the possible operators. This baseline platform is being customized to suit various roles. However in some cases there are many differences between various variants of the Ascot 2. Thank you for watching our video.